What's going on, Assassins? It's Starkstrider, and we're continuing the Taco Tuesday trifecta with Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Now, we're going to see what Sargon has for us for sale, hopefully something good for us to spend our ore on, and then we're going to check out what our weekly is, and after that, we're going to see what mercenary we're up against that we're going to be hunting down. So, as always, we begin with Sargon, and we're going to check out what he has so right off the bat, the Dagger of Hamakas. This is 25% uh, assassin damage, 50% adrenaline on assassination kill, 200% assassination damage when it's night for 100 ore. The Lion's Pride, part of the Nemean Lion set, 25% warrior damage, 50% crit damage, 10% crit chance, and 50% crit damage while full health for 80 ore. After that, we have the Javelin, 24% warrior damage, 20% assassin damage, 10% all damage for 50 ore. Pretty decent if you have a warrior assassin build. Reinforced leather gubs. 24% assassin damage, 30% melee resistance, 50% adrenaline on assassination kill for 40 ore. And you may want to get that just because it's got the melee resistance and you could be immune to melee. Olympian gift. This is uh, 20 ore and you're just gambling, possibly getting a epic or legendary item. So, Bounty on a Mercenary is our weekly where we're chasing the mercenary, and our other weekly is Skull Call. So we'll take a look at this, and we'll see what Skull Call involves. Then we'll see that mercenary. So, let's see. Uh, Skull Call. Kill followers of Ares all over Greece. Kill predators all over Greece. 15 apiece. So, uh, predators, obviously, any bear, boar, wolf, thing like that. Uh, you can find that all across. You'll find, you know, like uh, different hives and locations for them. Dens, lairs. And uh, the followers of Ares, one of the easiest places to go is right here, the Cave of Kratos. There's about seven of them in there. You do two runs, maybe three and you'll got them all. So let's take a look at which mercenary we are hunting down. And as I say all the time, well, as I say lately, we're gonna go and we're gonna bring him to our ship to make a ship build. So let's see, Edenos the Charging Bull, and he has the Bull Charger. It's got decent stats, not the best, it's whatever. Mid weapon, but what we're gonna do is uh, mark this off and then we're going to go and hunt him down. Where is he? So he seems to be a little bit south of us. We'll get over there and we'll see if uh, we could take him down. Hopefully he's uh, not that far and he's not. So what I want to do is get my paralyzing arrows ready. And I am going to blast him. Wow. He went down like a bag of si like rocks and whatnot. So here we go. We've got him. We're adding him to our ship. Uh, we got 44 ore because I'm the top tier mercenary. When you're S-Class, you get 44 rather than 40. And that counts for, uh, you know, like if you're attacking ships, doing weeklies, attacking mercenaries, or, you know, if you do a daily rather than 10 ore, you'll get 11 ore. So let's see. Here we go. We've got him in the purple flavor. And he's got decent stats. Oh, I've got a second version of him and a third. Look at that. Not bad. I wonder if I have a legendary flavor. Let's take a look. Let's see what we've got here. Uh-huh. Not too bad. All right. Well, that's all there is for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please make sure you like and subscribe. It helps this channel out an awful lot. As always, I want to thank each and every one of you for watching. And until next time, take care, be good, stay safe, take care of each other. I'll see you guys all in the next one. You know how we end this. Yeah, yeah.